Welcome to I Can Science That. Today I want to discuss the curve of the horizon. To keep these videos short, I've split it into separate subtopics. In this video, let's examine what a circle looks like when it's below eye level. This is a practical demonstration anyone can do for themselves. You just need a circle such as this hula hoop. Stand in the center of the hula hoop and hold it below eye level. Here I'm holding one at shoulder height. Look down at the circle and verify the curve. This is exactly what you'd expect to see looking down at a circle. Now, raise the hula hoop up to eye level. What does it look like when viewed edge on like this? The curve is gone from this point of view. Up at eye level, the circle of the hula hoop looks very straight. But if we lower it back to shoulder level, we can see the curve very clearly. Raise and lower the hula hoop to see how that changes the amount of curve you can see. I've put together a little 3D simulation here to try to help visualize exactly what we're talking about so that everything is completely clear. I have here a torus, so this is a hula hoop, right? This is a hula hoop um, and it's sitting on the ground. And our skeleton warrior here is standing right in the middle of the hula hoop. So that's what you would do. You put the hula hoop on the ground, stand in it. And as you, you look down, um, you see the edge of the hula hoop and it looks very curved. Now, this is the point of view of someone behind the, the observer. Let's put the point of view right on the observer. Let's do that. Boop. You are now looking through the eyes of the skeleton and he can't even see the hula hoop. So let's let him look down. Let's look down at the hula hoop a little bit. There you go. Looking down from the point of view of the skeleton. We can clearly see now that a circle viewed looking down on it, right? When you look down on a circle, it looks like a circle, right? It looks curved. It is curved from left to right. And we see that very clearly right there. Let's now raise the hula hoop up. So we want to raise it up. Let's bring it up to uh, shoulder level. So there it is at shoulder level. What does the observer, what does the skeleton see? Now when the hula hoop is at shoulder level, we still see a curve, but not as much, right? It's not as strong a curve. Raising the hula hoop has made the curve somewhat straighter in appearance. And if we continue to raise the hula hoop, we can raise it all the way to eye level here. And now the hula hoop looks almost straight. And it's a, because we're looking edge on, a circle viewed edge on, is basically straight. So this is what I'm trying to illustrate here. So if you have a circle and you are viewing the circle from above, looking down on it like so, you see a curve. You see the, the curve of the circle edge. But when you raise it up right up to eye level, that curve slowly goes away. Let's do that really slowly. So the farther down it is, the more curved it is. And if we slowly raise it up, it gets less curved and less curved and less curved until it's just barely curved. It's, oh, it's so barely, barely curved. And then if we continue, raise it up above eye level, it'll curve the opposite way, right? Now we're looking up at a circle and we see it curving the opposite way. So if it curves this way in the, in the top and it curves this way in the bottom, there must be a point right in the middle where it's straight. Maybe you suspect this is just CGI, this isn't real, it's just a simulation. We'll do it in reality, right? Just like I just showed in reality, do it with your own hula hoop, don't take my word for it. This is exactly what happens. To sum it up, 
a circle is curved as long as it's being viewed edge on like this any time it's below eye level. And what has that got to do with the horizon? The horizon is a circle. So if the circle of the horizon appears below eye level for some reason, that circle will appear curved. Flat earthers have many different opinions about the horizon. Some of them acknowledge that the horizon appears curved. Others insist that it's flat and always rises to eye level. Then there are those who argue that while the horizon may drop below eye level, it still does not curve left to right. Hopefully, this video is enough to establish that the horizon appearing below eye level is all it takes to make the horizon appear curved. Please keep in mind that while it is a circle, the hula hoop is flat. This tells us that the left to right curvature of the horizon is the same whether the Earth is a sphere or not. As long as the horizon is a circle and it appears below eye level, the curve is there. What remains is to answer, is the horizon a circle? Does the horizon drop below eye level? If you've answered yes to both of these, then it's time to stop arguing about left to right curvature. Instead, it might be more appropriate to investigate why the horizon drops with altitude, but that will have to be the subject for a future video.